From Euclid 6 version 7 onwards, Euclid provides the possibility to view the SPC Biocides Working Context in one of 25 languages other than the default English language. In this demonstration, I will elaborate how to enable the translation and show what is translated. Let's start with the table of contents view for the SPC Working Context. Here it is in English. The table of contents helps you to organize your data under specific headers or sections that indicate the type of information to be entered, such as the manufacturer of the bicycle product. If I move to the right, I see the rest of the working area of the SPC working context. I want to see this table of contents and any of the Euclid documents in the working area of the interface in the language of my choice. This is now possible for the SPC working context from Euclid 6 version 7 onwards. To do this, I will go to another tab so I keep the English for reference later. If I select the dashboard menu, which is available from almost anywhere in the interface, I will see a language selector under About Euclid. Clicking once on this, I can select the language I want to use for viewing the working area of my SPC. Let's select Finish and go to my SPC mixture data set, which I have created for this demonstration. The first thing to note is that all the primary headers of the table of contents are now in the language I selected. The name My Mixture is still in English because this is a text value I entered in, in English. However, in preparing my dossier, any of these text values can be entered in the language for which you are preparing your dossier. For example, I can change the name of my mixture to the language relevant to the dossier I'm preparing. After saving, this text value, which is now in Finnish, will be stored as part of my mixture contents. Let's see a bit more how the translation works by using the Finnish and English versions together. In the English version, I can go to manufacturer of the product and see a subchapter for the location of the manufacturing site. Let's do the same in Finnish. Here is the location of the manufacturing site in Finnish. As you can see, all of the table of contents for the SPC working context is translated, and this is repeated throughout. Let's see what else is translated. So far, we have seen that the table of contents is translated and that any text value can be entered in the relevant language of your choice. If we go into a compositional document, we can see two things. Firstly, each field label is translated. I put here in the value brief description, which is the English field label uh, for this field. Secondly, for fields where you can select from a drop down pick list, these predefined values are also translated. For example, in the country field, I've selected Austria and Finland in Finnish, as well as here in the component repeatable block, I've selected active substance in Finnish. As part of the enhancement to support data preparation in a language other than English, from Euclid 6 version 7 onwards, you can generate an SPC report that includes translations. The language used in the report is determined by the, la by the selection of language made in the dossier header. If we go to the English version, we can see in the dossier header that the current language is Finnish. Let's change this to English. And let's generate the report from here. And let's generate the SPC single, re single product report in a PDF output. Here is the English version. I've also generated previously the Finnish version so we can compare going forward. The report is based on the previous SPC editor report and the English version of this report was taken as the basis for translation. The report contains translations of the table of contents here, as well as uh, the various headers 
found in the report. And in fact, any text that is specific to the SPC report and does not come from Euclid itself uh, has its own translation. The report also includes the translated drop-down picklist phrases. These translations are taken from the picklist phrases as displayed in the Euclid user interface and are not specific to the report. Currently, in this version, only the function picklist is translated, but in future versions, all other picklist phrases will also be shown in their respective languages. If we take a, uh, a look at the first page of the report, we can see how the translation works if we compare the English and Finnish versions. The title is a title specific to the report and does not come from Euclid and is translated. As mentioned, this goes for all report specific texts. For example, the other, the other titles on the cover page, such as the product name or the authorization number. The text underneath the title, or for instance, the product name text is coming from Euclid and is reflecting the language I entered in Euclid itself. Let's look at the reports table of contents. Let's go to the Finnish version to show this. So now we're in the compositional section of the SPC report. Note here again that the section titles in section 2 and section 2.1 are translated into the language I selected in the dossier header. We can also see that the table titles are also translated and are report specific. Finally, we also have an example here of a picklist phrase defined in Euclid, which is also translated, the function of the active substance. This picklist phrase is not defined in the report, but is taken directly from the translation provided in the Euclid user interface.